We are here in Beaver Stadium with head coach James Franklin and coach coming home now in Beaver Stadium for almost the entire month of October. How important is it right now to begin kind of a three game homestand here with Minnesota in front of the home crowd at Beaver Stadium? Well, I think you look all over the country being at home, uh, you know, gives a great advantage you know, to, to us. Uh, gives a great advantage to teams all over the country. Um, so obviously, you know, this week being back home in our stadium, in Beaver Stadium, in front of our friends and family and all our supporters uh, is critical. And we're going to need that. We're going to use that energy. Um, you know, Minnesota's coming in here undefeated uh, with a lot of confidence. So it's going to be a tremendous challenge. Uh, we're talking about a trophy game. They have the trophy. They won last time we played. So uh, it's going to be a challenge. We're going to need all the fan support. And speaking of Minnesota, led right now by a veteran experienced quarterback in Mitch Leidner, what do you see from him in terms of his experience and the strengths that he, he brings and how you can plan to defend those? Yo, know, he's a big, strong, physical guy. You're talking about a guy who's six foot four, 220 plus pounds, um, and is also willing to run. He's, uh, I think he has 25 touchdowns, uh, the most touchdowns by a quarterback in school history. So he's a guy that's going to you know, uh, make you be honest. Um, very, very impressed with their running backs and their running game, a big physical offensive line. Uh, so it's going to be a challenge for us. You just mentioned that big physical offensive line really making a statement right now in the Big Ten. What do you see from them in terms of how you're planning to, to, to prepare against that? Well, you know, you just you just look at them. Those guys have been playing together. Um, they got really, really good size. I think the one tackle six nine, the one uh, tight end is six ten. They are big. They are long. They're physical. They've gone out and recruited some junior college players as well. That's come in and been able to help them. So yeah, that that's going to be a challenge for us. They're gonna they're gonna want to run the ball. Um, you know, their two backs, I think, are, are really good and very productive. Um, and then obviously the quarterback keeps you honest. So the combination of all those things is going to be a challenge for our defense. And from the offensive side, what do you need to see from the, from the Penn State offense this week? We saw some great things um, so far this season, but what do we really need to see this week? I think it's consistency. Um, you know, we got to be more physical up front. That's really on offense and defense. That's still an area I think we can improve. Um, you know, we got to be better on third down. I don't think there's any doubt about that. And then I think the other thing is we got to we got to open the games faster. You know, we need a, a touchdown in an opening drive. That's been a real focus for me and the staff this week of, of what can we do to prepare to, to start out the game and get some real good positive momentum on the offense side of the ball, which which will also help our defense. And then one final note on the season this year, we've really seen a lot of true freshmen and freshmen stepping up. In, in your experience and what you've seen, how would you assess kind of the, the, the youth movement that's going on right now and, and any freshmen in particular that are sticking out to you that are making a, a real strong impact? Well, I think it's a combination. A youth movement, I love how you call it that. Um, typically, that, that's a little bit by choice, and we kind of got a combination of both. We're doing it by need and doing it by choice. But it is exciting to see a guy like Cam Brown as a true freshman go in and, and have 10 tackles as a true freshman. Um, a guy that you know we didn't play early in the season and now have decided to play based on you know some of our some of our injuries and things like that. So so it's exciting. There's a number of young players. Miles has showed some flashes as well. Um, obviously, you know the the punter and Blake Gilligan are doing some really really nice things. So we've got a handful of freshmen that are are making a big impact. Probably nobody bigger than Blake Blake Gilligan. Great. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.